We'll come back to it. Let's go for four. A fortuitous boundary it was, but three of us have been bowled. Darren Goff is not impressed. India nine from a wicket. Oh, he's launched into that. He has launched into that, and that is a colossal hit. Where did that come out of? Just out of nowhere, literally. Squared himself up, and he has smashed that ball for six. Well, that's the prince. That's how he is. He'll play orthodox shots, and then he'll slog you. This is a slog. He'll get the right foot out of the way and slog it. You've got to have a great eye for that. A wonderful timing. And that'll do for four. Not a lot you can do about that as a bowler, you've got to give credit to the batsman. He's used his feet as he does, he made room for it, and he always goes slightly leg side to give his arms room to go, to free them, to give himself room. Oh, it's just a fantastic shot, isn't it? On the up, he stood up. He is a most fantastic timer when he's going. Nothing like that in the coaching book. Well, India have got to make an impression in the ICC trophy. This man, Saurav Ganguly, will have to play a huge, huge role. Down again, he dug it in short. He had to come scurrying back, Ganguly. Oh, that's, that's what gets the crowd all geared up, doesn't it? Great cricket, that. Bowlers do not like to see batsmen charging them. in the air and beautifully played he just gets enough on it and uh, as we saw at the over the other day that Lords has a very quick outfield as well but I agree with you there's a determination from the skipper today and it's coming out in his batting and he's going to take advantage of the field restrictions two more overs left well actually less than two overs uh, left so he's going to try and uh, get after Ashley Giles Michael Vaughan and a sweep shot out from the Indian captain. There'll be two here, possibly a third. Ashley Giles, good arm. Very good arm. And uh, it's 50 for Sir Ganguly, the Indian captain. He's led from the front. And uh, this has been well received by the Indian supporters here at Lords. 50 up for Ganguly. A little spell of spin. Not to Michael Warren anyway. Catch it. It's a big one. It is a big hit by the Indian captain. 50 partnership brought up by the six. I just said we uh, don't take any risk, but there was a risky shot that worked out. It was middle, from the middle of the bat. Literally out of the ground, right into the stands. Ganguly's on 65. Vaughan continues. Swept away. That's going all the way to four as well. Very nicely picked up. There was a fielder back there, but Saudi Muli, as you all know, is a very good player against the spin bowling. Picking up the back with perfection. There is a fielder there, you could have a see. He didn't have any chance to come near it. you can make up for it oh, that's up in the air and it will clear the ground a calculated risk taken there by Ganguly and it's come off there was a man at long off but the timing was good enough for the ball to go all the way <laughs> that's a gutsy shot after the first shot over the top, the man went back to long off. This time he's dragged it to the onside, only slightly. It's a good hit. He chanced his arm. He's hitting the ball well. He's seeing it well. So Harmison continuing. Out. The Indian captain falls 10 short of what would have been his 23rd century and Harmison has got his man. Well, he hit that reasonably decent. He, he just hit it sort of head high straight at the map. Um, 
I'm not sure he got, got it exactly as he wanted, but he could have hit it down or over the top. It would have cleared Michael Vaughan at mid-wicket, but uh, it's a shame. Really fine innings comes to an end. Told you, the Prince of Calcutta likes opening. It was a really good opening bat in one-day cricket. Super innings, 90 runs, 142 for four.